welcome welcome um earth sign people i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back we are going to be looking to see what is coming out for the earth sign this is uh, um the month of april and um remember that these readings are timeless i don't need to put that on my video whenever you receive these readings is the time for you earth sign to receive these message just about everyone okay all right so um um whoever watched the business channel there is a bi-monthly that is coming up so go check that out as usual you know we do the sun sign then the moon sign then all 12 houses so um, um at the bottom there is a timestamp to show up all 12 houses and the sun sign and the moon sign so use the um, stamp below in order to find out and choose whether you're a sun sign person or moon sign person capricorns I want to say to you Capricorns thank you thank you thank you so much thank you for the like shares and support thank you please share my videos Capricorn you rock absolutely thank you so much um, for your support all right um I think it's only Capricorn wants to know the truth <laughs> the rest can't take the truth but I love you Capricorns let's see what's coming out so first we're going to be um and remember if you are joining the channel in order to receive this reading you can use the link here to join it is $4.99 and it's for a month and you get everything okay so all the monthlies all the perks Ooh, la la capricorn something came out about money nine of pentacles some of you could be losing or receiving some money in this period so whatever it co comes up um I, something about some money all right so all right let's look at the sun sign capricorns and see what is coming up i love you guys thank you for being here so i see changes are coming up uh there is no movement but changes is going to be coming up however this is transpiring i see some of you realize that um a relocation is going to be best for you okay so however that is transpiring i see a situation with um uh you young ladies um 18 to 45 you're going to be realizing that a relocation is much better and i see some of you young ladies have to pay back a whole lot of money i see the truth is going to be coming out whatever is transpiring truths or here truth is going to be coming out so whatever that was transpiring um with an aquarius i see truths are coming out you young um women and men stand up in this reading you women are in the reverse and you have to pay back a taurus a young man a lot of money however that is transpiring i see that some of you need to stand your ground some of you have lost the zest in life however that is transpiring i see there is no win there is no movement for you um young men okay whatever is transpiring i see the energy that some of you need to protect yourself from a fire sign person this person is a little bit not good in the head the person has stolen a lot of money and i see the truth is coming out and i see that um, you guys are going to be giving up this person because you know the truth about this person you know that this person used someone else's name in order to acquire financial stability and i see you're going to be giving them up so what we're seeing for you fire sign person is that some of you wants to relocate because you realize that it is better you can't protect yourself wherever you are um i see you need to stand your ground against a young fire sign person whoever this person is i see this person is deceptive she has stolen a lot of money okay um young ladies um young ladies and men i see some um play with the lovers is coming out i see some of you so um young ladies and men between the age of 18 and 45 i see some play i see um some situation with the lovers you could be connecting with a new love however this is it fell out for the young people between the ages of 18 and 45 i see a lot of happiness and joy and a lot of play that is going on all right so um then we see no movement for you young men so you young men who always travel for your work i see no movement i see money is a uh, getting low on you young men and women because there's no movement and i see money is getting low on you young men and women 
I see that some of you are going to be finding out that Aaliyah has stolen a lot of money and I see that this money is going to be returned because I see you're going to be speaking up about a young Aries Leo or Sagittarius okay so let's see what is coming in for the Capricorn Sun sign people so I see a lot of you want to relocate there is no happiness anymore anymore where you are some of you want to relocate so that is for people between the age of 18 and 45 some of you could be alone there is um you're unhappy there is no happiness anymore and I see you want to relocate for you young men between the age of 18 and 45 I see you thinking about um, a past love um, I see you're seeing the truth about this person I see you really realize that this person was the love of your life um, you're wishing and hoping that you had done differently to this person when you were in a relationship it's as if this person is always on your mind for whatever the reason is you are so in love with this person um you wonder sometime if this person is thinking about you and you realize that you have just made the wrong decision um and you wish that you could make time change time i see a situation with a leo a leo is going to be caught no more sadness a leo is going to be caught because they see the lies and deceptiveness of a leo However, this is transpiring. There is no forward going with a Leo because they found out a deceptiveness. Some of you need to stand your ground. There is no traveling that is going to be going on for you guys. Okay. So, you know, let go of the sadness. There is a, a no traveling that is going to be going on for you guys. All right. So this little deceptive um, fire sign person, um, this person is not going anywhere. This person is going to be um charge and um for the 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 what she has stolen um they have realized that this young fire sign person has stolen a lot of money she needs to repay the money and she's not going anywhere she is not going anywhere so all of your cards except love for you men um and it's um for you men is up okay so i see you young ladies you have to pay back um pay back some money for whatever the the this uh, pay back some money because they saw that you done some deceptiveness okay um for um sun sign people with your business your business is looking really really good i see your business is going to be coming very international and um, the sadness is going to be over some of you had to fight with a deceptive situation with a young leo okay the leo is coming up they're not moving forward okay so i see transition is coming up as i said leo so whoever is having issues with leo transition is, is coming up and i see um new opportunities is so as some of you a leo had blocked your way and now they're finding out the lies and deceptiveness of this leo um whether it was via love or emotional or how it has played out okay so i see the energy of uh, um relocation some of you young women are thinking about relocating and i see you are going to be um successful doing that so some good news is going to be coming in if you are thinking about relocating it is a good idea and i see you're definitely going to be doing that so you're going to be some of you were having some issues with an Aquarian, um, gem, an, an Aquarian person, you're going to be getting over this. I see you're protecting yourself because you're very saddened and you're protecting yourself. However, this is transpiring. I see you Capricorn, Sun Capricorns are not really open. There is no happiness. You're really saddened and you are going to be, um, you're going to be overcoming a situation, but, um, relocation is best for you. I see situations with families. People are seeing the truth about a family situation. I see that some of you, especially you, you young men, this is going to be affecting young men or men on a whole, that the truth came out about family situation and the love of your life. People are finding out that you were in love with someone. Whoever this person is, there was some issues around this person and people are going to be finding out that this or that person was the love of your life, okay? Um, they're going to be realizing that the love has never stopped between you and this person or some of people are just going to be finding out that you were in love with someone. Now, whoever this person is, is a young lady. Um, and this could be a past love or this could be someone you have met, 
but you have spent a lot of time with this person and however it happened there was some deceptive play on your side and now you're regretting that because now um i see you men are you know i'd hope that you had done things differently some of you need to stand your ground and protect your emotions um number 77 is here for you guys so you need to stand your ground and protect your emotions so i see 12 the energy of the hangman and three um a cycle is not yet over with a deceptive situation with a leo uh three and um six is nine so i see that um this cycle is not yet over with a leo whatever is happening and whatever is transpiring I see that your emotions, you need to protect your emotions. Whatever is transpiring, protecting your emotions. You're on the right part. Let go of the sadness. You are on the right part. Let go of the sadness. You're on the right part. I told you it was a Leo. Some of you are going to be moving forward, leaving this person behind. You're not certain about what has transpired with this person. You think that they deserve exactly what they receive because of some lies and deceptiveness. I see you guys moving away and leaving this person behind and their deceptive um, situation. You are not saddened anymore, however, this person. I see you stand your ground and you're going to be taking down a young fire sign person. Whoever this young fire sign person is, it is um, um, some illegal. This person is illegal. Whoever this person is, wherever you are, this person is illegal. And they're going to be finding out that this young fire sign person is very illegal. There's a lot of nines. There's a lot of cycles. There's a lot of ending. So we have another nine and we have another five um so nine and five in a corporation institution yeah they're going to be finding out that this young fire sign person was illegal okay so whatever is transpiring i see they're going to be realizing that this young fire sign person was illegal and as i said justice is going to come down on this person there is no movement for this person and they're not going to be receiving a new chance because they found out that this fi young fire sign person was illegal whatever this person has done um now the truth is coming up they can't find any fingerprint for this young fire sign person her fingerprint doesn't match anything else and they realize that the lady was just bloody illegal stealing other people information and using other people information so this one is caught whatever that is transpiring this one is totally caught um nine and five um yeah changes the truth is coming out a huge investigation is taking place against a young fire sign person. They're going to be realizing that the fingerprint for, of her was not, nowhere to find and that um, she was deceptively using other people's um, information. Okay? So, what we're seeing here is that we're seeing the truth over a deceptive lawyer, and this is a Taurus lawyer. Um, however, this is transpired. It could be a Taurus lawyer or a business person. Some, um, and this is a legal issues with your business. So it could be a, a, a deceptive lawyer or it could be a deceptive businessman. I see um, this person try to deceive you out of a lot of money, whatever that was happening and transpiring. This person really deceived you out of a lot of money. So I see a friend is going to be helping you. Yeah, it is. Um, a Taurus um, businessman I said it and here it is a Taurus businessman trying to deceive you out of a lot of money but they're going to be catching this person there is this person is just so um, horrible deceptive whoever this person is but it's a Taurus um, businessman and I see they're going to call to him for what he has done uh, definitely a Taurus businessman they're definitely going to be, um, yeah, he's going to be caught for what he has done. So, um, uh, sun sign people, I see good news is coming in about the family. I see multiple opportunities. Doors are going to be opening. I see emotion with the family is going to be good. Whatever the situation is, some of you are dealing with it. This fire sign child could have been, um, your child. However, this is happening and playing out, but I see whatever the conflicts, but it has to do with someone else. This fire sign person is connected with someone else. Okay. So I see the truth is going to be transparent. You are protecting yourself. Some of you men have regrets over a lover that you had never, 
um, you know, let this person know how much you love them. I see your heart is open for this person, but there is no communication. You ladies, um, and whatever is transpiring, I see justice is coming up on um, some fire sign people that is affecting you guys. So be aware of this. All right. So we're moving forward and we're going to be um, looking at the sun sign people. So again, I see um, for you young ladies, you want to relocate. You're not happy. Um, you want to leave and relocate because you're not happy. Whatever is transpiring. Then I see you young men. Um, or men on a whole is worried about uh, um, some deceptive play that has transpired with a family and um, you see the truth about your family and why they didn't want you to be with someone and you realize that your family has I, I actually ruin you because they try to make decision for you which affects you in the wrong way some of you are going to be thinking about relocating and it's the best thing you can do. Um, it is going to be especially good for young people, be people, um, young people. So I see you're going to be planning because you can't do it now, but you're going to be planning. Truths are going to be coming out. Whatever the issue in the situation is, truths with family are going to be coming out. Be aware of that because it is definitely coming up. Some of you are saddened because you can't travel. You can't go anywhere. You have to stand still. I see some of you. Um, yeah, it is all about, this is all coming up. And this was what I was saying to you guys that it's called all coming up. I see some of you are protecting yourself emotionally from a Leo person, whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring because you realize that, um, this situation is just so deceptive. I see definitely some of you are taking down a fire sign person, whoever this fire sign person is. Some of you are going to be taking down this fire sign person, whoever this fire sign person is. Um, you are going to be uh, taking down this fire sign person. Now we have the energy of the Ace of Pentacles. However, this is transparent. The truth is coming out about whatever that was playing. So I am moving forward and I'm going to be seeing what is coming up for the moon earth sign <gasps> people. Whew, I said the moon earth sign people and I see tower moment in reverse. All right, so moon, okay. Tower moment in reverse, okay. So, oh, the, um, okay. So let's see what is coming out for the moon, um, earth sign people for um the month of April. Remember that these readings are um timeless, and whenever you pick them up, it's the time you should have these readings. So for the moon, I see um communication. I see information is coming. Um, to you, a uh, moon, um, earth sign, people, your burden. The communication that is coming in is going to be releasing your burden. So that is good. Then we see a secrets, the eye princess. So some of you could be receiving um, spiritual message that is coming in, the eye princess. And I see you're going to be old and tight because whatever the information that you're going to be receiving, um, it's um, information that you are going to find strength to deal with. I see the energy of the Queen of Swords, whoever this person is, whatever is transpiring. I see some of you are going to become the energy of the Queen of Swords. It has to do with money. Some of you are going to be finding out that some money was taken from you and this money. I see some of you, you need to stand up against this um, Queen of Swords, whoever this person is, because I see if you do that, a healing is going to be coming in. So let's see. Um, woo! Okay. Okay. Bam, 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 bam. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the first time this energy is coming up straight up upright. And it's for you moon sign Capricorn, whatever is transpiring, especially people, your moon sign people, because the eye princess is here. You're taking down everything. It's like you guys are creating balance in corporation, institution, organization, victory and success. This is the victory and success. Bam, bam, bam. Because remember, I was um, shuffling and no, but I have been prepping these readings, doing these readings. No one else. It comes up always in reverse. And I, I like shuffle every time. Comes up all in the reverse. So let's see what's coming out for the Capricorn moon sign people with all these energy. Information is coming in that is going to be releasing your burden. 
So let's see what that's all about. It's about a child. Whatever that was happening to a child, I see some information is going to be coming out that is going to be releasing your burden. If you don't have a child, if you're in a child, it's as if you're going to be healing something about your inner child. The child is in reverse. So it could be you dealing with issues with your inner child. Now, what I'm seeing is now 47 is 11. Um, so some of you, there could have been some legal issue with an, a child, okay? And this legal issue is going to be over. That is going to be releasing you from that burden. And this is good. Then I see the energy of a letter. A letter is going to be coming in or a letter should have come in. A letter can, yeah. And whatever is in the letter, it could be about your child. Whatever is in the letter, it is about your child. Whatever is in the letter is some secrets that you weren't aware of. And, um, the strength i see d that transition um i see the transition for an aquarian gemini or libra person whoever this person is i see mother <laughs> um um yeah so whoever this person is i see elin is coming up for a legal issue um whatever has transpired i see some elin is coming in to a legal issue um did you win yes you're dead okay so if you're a lawyer um there is a legal issue that you're not going to be winning because you're in the reverse uh, again whatever is transpiring ladies and gentlemen number 47 or 74 is playing a significant role in your lives new start are coming up 13 debt murder um this is the energy of someone who tries to use their power i see they came down on you so someone who used their power in the wrong way i see some sadness for lawyers out there whatever however this is transpiring um because of some deceptiveness that has transpired um i see some sadness is coming out wow okay um moon sign people so there is a lot of major arcana that is transpiring a lot of major arcana that is transpiring however this is happening and transpiring i see a lot of major arcana that is transpiring at this time and we have the eye princess and the strength we have whoever this queen is and this new star i don't see it's happening i see murder and then i see lawyers there is something that you they picked you lawyers up and saw what you have done so i see you're open for an healing so let's look the knight of swords a younger person you have to make a decision about an aquarian gemini or libran if this is your child you need to make a decision about this person okay some of you information could be coming in the, about a child that you have to make some decision over then I see a tower moment um, with a, a situation with a child um, that is going to um, release your burden. So I see that some of you, your kids were in some problems. I see this is going to be ending because whatever is transpired, I see a huge tower moment has come down. Um, and um, this is going to be ending this disruptive and because it's duality that is going on some of you were dealing with a liberal and i see you're going to be overweighting whether or not you should go forward with this liberal secrets secrets about um, a woman a pisces cancer a scorpion this could be a pisces woman whoever this woman is um this woman um has is psychic this woman could be um delivering news via the psychic channel um and you're finding strength to deal with this this news is going to let you just turn your back on um a deceptive play and a deceptive situation so this is definitely a situation eight nine ten it's with a pisces woman and some information that is going to be coming in or it could be um if your mother is a pisces or whoever the pisces woman in i see uh, some uh, situation love is in the reverse so whatever is transpiring i see that some people are like um the love is in reverse so it has to do with um an aquarian gemini or libra or some of you is not receiving love but it doesn't really and it's for um, for an organization institution 
um, that is um, this is coming up for I see the end I see you wanted a new start with a corporation institution but some of you um, is not getting the new start I see with work you're totally on top of your game whatever is transpiring um, it's going to be affecting work is going to be affecting the lawyers you're in the reverse and I see a situation with the end of a contract for some of you lawyers these are lawyers um, and business people I see some of you um, need to pay back some money so the end of a situation with some of you lawyers this energy is a lawyer or a judge or business people there is just all of your energies is in reverse now um so uh, some of you wanted a new I, I see a tower moment and some of you are walking away from a corporation institution so some of you could be ending um, your work whatever is transpiring I see some of you could be ending your work and um, some of you are really going to be trying to figure out a situation um, with either a legal issue with a child or because you're going to be receiving some messages the most important is that I see victory and success victory and success is here and I see people have to pay you a lot of money out okay um, the sadness is over I see a situation with your fortune and people try to take your fortune however this is plain but I see you're going to be victorious and successful over whatever is transpiring it's just a really really weird reading okay really weird so I see um, it could be the inner child conflicts with your inner child that is happening I see a letter that is coming in from a Pisces cancer a scorpion I see debt transition is coming up with a corporation institution debt and transition no one is dying but it's just and I see lawyers especially in their work communication and that sort of a thing the end of uh, a contract with the work that is open up some of you could be wanting to buy a house or it's going to be thinking to find another house to relocate however this is transparent but I see working from out home I see that this is going to be in and it's coming up for like lawyers judge and that sort of a thing however this is transpiring but I see a lot of you because the tower moment fell out and a lot of you whatever is transpiring I see a letter about a child um, an end to a legal issues is coming up for some of you so a letter about a child end to a legal issues is going to be coming up for some of you so um, this is good okay so it could be you're receiving some information from your child or about your child um, it could be um, a, you know birth um, transition uh, end to a legal issue that was transpiring with your child there is just a lot that is going on here then we see your burdens is going to be over because the tower moment is coming down and this is good so whatever that was transpiring your burdens is going to be over a tower moment I see truths are going to be um, out information is coming in where you have to make some uh, decision then I see you are standing your ground you're finding in a strength to just turn your back to a deceptive situation and walk away I see information is going to be coming in via the psychic channel from a Pisces cancer a scorpion person um, they're going to be letting you on some secrets that has transpired I see the energy of the ace of Pentacles some of you wanted a new start with a corporation um, maybe it happened maybe it doesn't happen for some of you yes for some of you no. okay however it is let it go uh, I see no love coming from this person whoever this person is whether it's a lawyer or whatever um, and it is okay you're like goodbye whatever I seen through um, the deceptiveness that you were playing so however this is transpiring um, whoever this lady is um, she is not sending you any love it could be a boss an ex boss that has found out what you have done and no communication with this person nothing and you know however this is transpiring I see you're taking it one day at a time in a work I see most of you are focusing on work and really completely focusing and looking at what you're doing and fully completely um, getting in what you are doing so um, be aware of that then we see a healing that is coming up with a work situation 
um, and for some of you are healing in the home however this is transparent and happening this is a healing that needs to be done this is a karmatic situation so let's move on and see what is coming up in the 12th house uh, so we are looking at the houses remember um uh, Taurus says you are the second house okay um then we have the Virgo in the sixth house Capricorn you are the tenth house okay so remember that if you would like a personalized reading because these readings are just um these readings my darlings they are just um general okay so remember that go use the link and uh, um go to the website where you can find uh where you can find um the extended okay so remember that these readings are extended okay so let's look i'm going to go each house one by one to find out what is transpiring okay so um, the first house I see the Capricorn you're going to be having issues with yourself Capricorns okay you're in the first house you fall in the first house so it's all about you um in these four weeks it's all about you uh Leo and the Vir Leo fall in the Virgo house <laughs> okay um Virgos you're de dealing with an issue with a Leo okay Capricorn what fall in your house is a Aries I see a Aries try to ruin your reputation and Virgo, you are in the 11th house. Taurus, you are in the house of marriage relationships. Okay. So remember this. Okay. So Taurus, you fall in the house of marriage and relationship. Virgos, you fall in the house of coming to the edge with groups, corporation, institutes, the organization. So, um, uh, yeah, because you're not connecting. So I see you're going to be focused. So some of you Virgos could have created something. Another group or organization is trying to pick it up or so. Okay. So be aware of that. So love for yourself, Capricorn. So this is good. Uh, so Capricorn is loving themselves and the money aspect going with the flow of the money um, in the environment. I see an end is coming with a family. There is a lot of issues for you or sign people. Luck with um people, the sun people, especially the Virgos, is going to be looking good. Tauruses, you're going to be finding that the person you're in a relationship with is the right people. Um, opposite of what um, is going on, unexpected luck with the Geminis in the ninth house. So, so ninth house is the house. Uh, why is the Gemini? So some of you are going to be having a um, lock um, break choose about a Gemini. Okay. Whoever this Gemini is, the ascendance surrendering. Um, this, um, this situation keep on coming up. Pluto transition and, and, and Pluto. Okay. I see an Elin. I see you have luck over a cancer and a Leo. So you earth sign people a block over a cancer and a Leo. Mm, 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 mm. Money looks good. Money is going in the right flow. Let's see what is coming up for the earth sign people for April. Yep, I did say. Oh, yeah. Mm, mm, mm. Family. Yeah, there's conflicts in the house. Conflicts about a house. Conflicts in the house. Ooh, 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 ooh. Office. Ooh. <laughs> oh yeah mm, 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 mm. okay love is the answer okay so the spirit is all about love relationship i told you there could be transition in relationship it's all about love i see pluto i see the situation with a house i see wife um problems with kids wife relationship in a house however this is coming up however this is transpired it's all about love for you earth sign people um love um relationships could be ending okay Whew, okay so we're looking at the first house the first house who falls in the first house the first house is the self okay so i see um a lot of you are going to be learning to love yourself whatever is transpiring i see a lot of you are going to be learning to love yourself um because love that is the love venus is in 
um, your house, your first house of self. And a lot of you are going to be loving, learning to love yourself and thinking about building on your financial stability. Now, Capricorn, this is a house where it's all about uh, focusing on your work. You can see this loving your work because this is all about work. This is all about the financial and Capricorn is just going to be focusing because you fell in the house of self. So you're loving yourself and focusing on your work. It's more about you're not loving um, anything else, but loving your work and focusing on your work. OK, so that is what is coming up for the Capricorns. And for the rest of you, it's about all about loving yourself now. Um. Second house is the house of the Tauruses. Tauruses, I see unexpected luck from overseas is going to be coming in. So I first do the Tauruses or you guys. Um, unexpected luck um, with um, business foreign voyage. So if you have business overseas, it's going to create you uh, create a lot of money for you. OK, you're going to be receiving a lot of uh, message. Why are we having two letters? Okay, so you are going to be receiving letters um, that is going to let you know that some um, money could be coming in from your business from overseas. However, this is transpiring. I see if you have business overseas, this is going to be bringing in a lot of money. Okay, so whoever you are and however your business is flowing, I see um, if you have anything on um, this business, whoever has a business, or work or whatever it's going to be and uh, contracts are going to stay the same your, your your financial flow is going to get much better Tauruses I see your business opportunities is overseas and it's you're going to either start or have and it's going to keep a balanced flow of your financial problems so hurt sign people you have absolutely no uh, situation with your financial flow in this period then we look at the third house environment okay and there is uh, um, some of you the third house is uh, where you lived your resident um, your siblings um, people who you're dating I see some of you are dealing with a Pisces I see maybe this could be ending um, I see a lot of delirious situation that is going on between you and a Pisces so whoever is in a relationship with a Pisces and live with a Pisces um, or a Pisces, if you is your sibilance, I see some delirious situation where at our moment, this is Mars. Mars could be ending a relationship, okay? Or people are just behaving really crazy, okay? It's a full moon. So be aware of this, that this person could be going off at you at every moment and very delirious. So be aware of this. Um, then we look at the house of family. Some of you are having some huge issues with your child and a house that is a scorpion. So um, this is a child for some of you. This is a family member. Uh, it could be a sister or a brother, but it's a family member. And it's as if uh, this person is trying to take over a house that is not for them. Okay, this person could have used your information to buy a house also. And now they're going to be finding out what has transpired. And there is a lot of conflicts about this house. This house is not for him. If it's a child, it's not for him. And I would say, take the house, sell it and take the money because this person is being very deceptive. This person doesn't think that because you're their parents, you have to give them. I would have sold it bloody hell. So, however, that is coming up, ladies and gentlemen, you kind of figure that out because kids always think that you give them nine years of your life, breed them, bring them in this world, and it's always fighting about some house. And I see a lot of Capricorns are having this issue, but this is really a Scorpion person, and they are like, uh, I need the house or I need the money. No, if it's not your house and the house was left in the family, um, no, and I see if you have never looked for your grandkids or grandparents or whatever. No, don't give them the house. So what the hell? All right, positive. So I see some of you who, um, some of you luck is with the cancers. So, so we're in the house of passion, the fifth house, part is friendship. I see luck is with the cancers. Whatever is transpiring, I see some of you working ladies are going to be connecting with the cancers. I see you're going to be having a lot of fun time with a cancer. I see a cancer is coming in your life and it's going to be bringing you some luck. So this is good. So 
in the house of pleasure i see some of you whoever you are especially working ladies i see your luck lies by a cancer cancer is going to be bringing you guys some luck however that is transpiring then um this is uh, virgos this is beautiful especially for the sun virgos whoever you sun virgos are um you are going to be having a lot of luck now virgos i see you dealing with an issue with a leo and whatever is transpiring a leo is going to be creating some issues for your daily um actions and your daily thing whoever this leo is and whatever is transpiring but i see you're going to be successfully overcoming this leo so all you virgos whether sun or moon sign person you are going to be overcoming this virgo and taking back your fortune this virgo is very deceptive and i see you virgos are going to be taking down a leo for the rest of the sign um because this is the house of the virgo so if a capricorn or a, a taurus have an issue with a, a leo i see the virgos are going to be making sure that boats are going to be very 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 um stable as to what is going on so this is um absolutely fabulous because i see you successfully taking back your fortune from a a, a leo okay whoever they are so all of you all of you who were having issues with Leo and they were using their powers against you or whatever. Seventh house of relaxation. Um, that is with marriage. So Taurus is um, I see you are going to be realizing that you're in the relationship with the right person. This is who you want to be with. So you Tauruses are going to be choosing for someone. For the rest of you, I don't see any conflicts. I see that people right now, they're not loving on anyone except themselves. Only you Tauruses um, realize that your marriage or your relationship is what where you need to be at this time. So this is good. But for the rest of the sign, they're all focusing on the money. Okay? And this is good. All the rest of the sign is just focusing on the money. Um, but in love, uh, the Tauruses are showing up. So... In the eight house of relationship karma inheritance, I see some of you are dealing with an Aquarian's legalities uh, with inheritance and that sort of a thing, an opposite of the track because of children and other people that is fighting for your legacy. So, um, the Kundalini energy and inheritance. This is more coming up as inheritance and uh, people trying to figure out who this is and what is this all about so what is here going to be transpiring and it's going to be happening i see that some of you are just going to be taking down a scorpion and say the hell no um this is not yours um this is from my family coming down my bloodline you have never done anything for my parents so no you're not getting the house and i see you're just going to cut this person off because you realize that this person has used your information and acquire assets and then want everything that you have no that's not how it goes this person let it go people take a personalized reading now in the house of the ninth house foreign i see some unexpected news is going to be coming in about a gemini so some of you are dealing with a gemini whoever this gemini is or a relationship some unexpected news is going to come in about your marriage if you're married to someone who is a foreigner or uh, come from overseas i see some unexpected information now let's say that a gemini was trying to work against you or you're in a relationship with a gemini i see some information is going to come from overseas about this gemini and you're going to be finding out that this gemini and their partner is in some serious serious problem overseas bam 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 so um whoever this gemini is and they were this gemini partner could be um some um some foreigner okay and they're going to be finding out something so let's say that this gemini is your friend or someone who you know or a foreigner they're going to be finding out that uh, um you know they wanted to reunite with you but i see some unexpected news is going to be coming in telling you something about they and their partner that is going to be helping you earth sign people all right, Capricorn, I see you um, in the tent house of reputation. I see some of you, your reputation is going to be healed. 
but Capricorns, I see you taking down a little false Aries person. Capricorn, I see you are ravishing this Aries person, a very false Aries person. And I see they try to ruin your reputation. This is a young, sly, nasty little person. And Capricorns, you're rooting out them, this person. So be aware of that. So you're going to be seeing and you're going to be showing up this false, deceptive person. I see a Elin is coming in for the reputation of the hurt sign people. But Capricorns, you're taking down this person. Whoever this person is, it's like, bye, bye, bye. Don't you even try. Rest of you, your reputation is going to be ill. As we go to the uh, 11th house, the house of groups, community, um, humanitarian. Um, I see some Virgos. This is going to be your house, but there is some mystery around groups, corporation, organization. I see you are rethinking um, Virgos. So Virgos, you fall in this house. This is the house of the Aquarians. But this is the house of uh, groups, organization, social group, and that sort of a thing. But I see you, Virgos, really thinking what is better. However, this is happening and transpiring. I see you, Virgos, really thinking. I see this house, the energy of the um the the energy of the ascendance mass. This is going to come in um because it's like coming to the edge. So it's as if you, Virgos, are receiving so much information. Um, that you're thinking, yeah, too much information, too much information. It's about coming to the edge, okay? Then we see the energy of the 11th and the 12th house, the 12th house of surrender. Um, and it has to do with the house of the Pisces. So I see if you're married to a Pisces, if earth sign person is married to a Pisces, I see you ladies are going to be deciding, um, to either make it legal if you were living with a pisces have kids with a pisces i see you're going to be making it legal but for some of you this could be but um it is the outlook that you're realizing this is a person this is where you're healing a situation with a pisces so it could be a mother child healing but it could be also legal issues and situation separation and you're healing a situation however this is coming up and transpiring um, it is with a Pisces, but Pisces are going to be helping you guys, whether as lawyers, uh, as um, partners, as kids, in order to heal a situation. Because this is the house of karma. So a lot of karma is going to be healing and Pisces is going to be helping you. So this is wonderful and positive because whatever the issue and the situation is, it is a positive um, situation that is transpiring and happening. Um, uh, and and this 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 um love letters could be coming in for some of you, but uh, there is two letters and what it whatever is transpired, I see the messenger, yeah, letter is go going to be coming in. So however that is transpiring, I see a letter is going to be coming in, and but it's going to be good because it's going to be helping your financial stability. I love your heart signs, and um, uh, enjoy. Namaste.